so this is Day Dog coming back to you with another uh, Auto Royale chess video. Um, hold, hold. So uh, I've been playing a bit. Of, I've been playing this a bit. Just. Like, I didn't play yesterday, and I don't think I played the day before. Because I've been playing a lot of other games, too. And I came back today and started playing and realized... Wait a second, I've played quite a few games here, and there's a lot of games I think I should have been doing a lot better. I started realizing, wait a second, there's like one star units of the same <laughs> unit kicking my my other units is butts and it was like how does that work and I guess the answer to that would be uh, it's not supposed to but uh, the leveling system <coughs> in uh, an earlier video that I did of this I had mentioned that yeah you guys actually level up like, um, I don't mean in the game, I mean outside of the game. When you come into the game, some of your characters are like, say, level 8, and then some of them are like level 2. When you have a whole bunch of much higher characters, they start to destroy the lower, the, the people, well, I mean the characters that are not leveled up, even if the ranks are supposed to factor in. So... Considering it's a pay-to-play game a bit, um, I'm starting to take my uh, my uh, I'm starting to back off this game. I think because well, obviously it's gonna it's rewards you if you're playing every day. But for those that don't play every day and invest, like making sure they get their their 12 crowns in twice a day, whatever. Well, those people are not being rewarded at all, and they're coming in and say, for instance, they might actually be a lot better at these kinds of games. But because... Because the game rewards people that play more, or people that spend money on the game, and the people that are not doing that are just... Until they develop a better ranking system or something at least. Like, the people that don't spend... Or... Get extremely lucky. Or... Whatever, whatever. They're never going to beat the high, the, the people that have been playing like every day or are spending money on the game. So, like, I'm surprised I'm doing... Well, I'm not doing good. I'm getting destroyed, like... I'm getting... Like, I got two lives left. I don't think I'm gonna make it through the round. Uh, I'm gonna put him in, because I know he's one of my stronger units. Like, I know he's got more s levels than other of my characters, so I'm gonna put him in. Now, I'm not just... Not because of synergies, just because I know he's one of my higher level units so I think that kind of I think I had mentioned it prior though that I, I don't know why I didn't think that it really was going to be a big issue but yeah synergies don't think about synergies just put your highest units in because if you're not putting your highest, your highest, your highest units in well it's probably not going to work out for you No, who's once? Okay. So yeah. Like I think I'm not sure if that was because the unit I took out and sold was I don't know, because on paper, 
that unit should have been better. But what was that? What did I even sell? I didn't even pay attention because I know technically that unit should have been better. But uh, was he better? Probably not. I'm gonna put him, I have to put him in like I gotta survive. I'm gonna lock this. Now this is supposed to be a good unit, right? Oh, and I know that that is too. Oh no, I can't get both. Like. The struggles. Six. There's no way I can put him in. I sh maybe I should have kept him. Look. Oh. Oh, this is hard. Yeah. No, it's weird. I know that uh, it's supposed to have less units and smaller grid and all that. I still think they should have an 8 bar though. Like, you wanna only have 6 by 6? Yeah, okay, I, I see that. Uh, wow, like, what am I supposed to do? So you guys might think, okay, maybe he just sucks. But I'm going to show you what I'm talking about right here. Oh, free gold, yay. I'm going to show you guys exactly what I mean. This is it right here, see? Gold to level up your bazooka. Gold to level up your Darius. Now, also chests. Now, for the people that play every day... You get some extra gold, and if you're playing, like, say you use your crowns in the morning, and then you use your crowns at night, you know, um, like, you make sure you get all your games in to get all your crowns in the morning, and you make sure to get all your games in to get your crowns at night, then you're getting, like, all that. Every chess, which you can get uh, three chests a day. Four chests a day, four chests per eight hours approximately, or per 12 hours, I'm not sure, I think it's about eight hours. So, uh, four chests every 12 hours, now, boom, then you can level up your guys. And see my guys, three, four, 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 five, five, four, blah, 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 nobody's really high in like... I don't even have any of these that are level 2 or anything, like, I have one level 2 in the, the 3 star guys, the blue guys, whatever. My strongest units, I was trying to get those guys earlier because I was like, well, they're, I know they're strong. So, um, yeah, so let's, uh, is this leaderboards? What is this? Clans? Can we see leaderboards? Okay, can we see these guys? Oh yeah, they won't let me see nothing there. Eh? Yeah. He's French. Like, from Quebec. He's a Quebecer his little last name. I'm not going to explain it, but yeah, I'm French, and I know what that word means. So, uh, not only am I French, but I'm a Quebecer, and um, yeah, it's not, it's not like French from France, it's Quebecer French. Yeah, and uh, yeah, so we'll just leave it at that. But I wish I could see these people's, like, lineups and stuff, like, because, um, if I could, 
I'm almost 100% sure that, as I was saying, they got stacked guys here. All their units are all stacked up. So... I guess that's the, that's the, that's the game, right? But, um... Okay, suggestion to the makers of this game. Um... I know you want to make money and stuff, and uh, let all the other games do it. That's great. You have two options. Either you do, like, the other auto chesses, and you... I think you might... <sighs> okay. Yeah. First and foremost, I would take out... Um, the, you can leave the money in it. And... Uh, there should be two forms of currency. And I don't mean like, okay, we'll say three forms of currency. The gems, because you do whatever you want with the gems. And then gold. And then we'll call it experience. Whatever. Now, the experience should be for the units. And uh, that should not be able to be bought. The only way you should be able to get experience is by playing the game. The more you play the game, the more you can get experience and level up your guys. You should not be able to buy gold to level up your characters, first and foremost, number one. Um, so therefore... This screen right here, you gotta take that Darius and Bazooka, you gotta, t you gotta get rid of that. Or you somehow have to put it in experience, where basically you can't you can't have people can't be actually spending money to get the advantage over other people is what I'm saying. They can be spending time to get more trophy chests to get ahead, and then maybe spending experience, which you can't buy with gold, to buy these units. Okay. Now, all your gold should be used for cosmetic stuff. For things that don't really affect the game, like all the other auto chess games, because you are trying to imitate auto chess games, right? So if you want to get the auto chess fan base to actually play the game, you can't give an unfair advantage to people that like to spend money on games because that is what's really going for the auto chess games. It's not just it's not just the the games themselves. It's not just their their genre. Yes, the genre is popular, but the reason why the genre is really popular in the succeeding ones, the ones that will have a longer lifespan and have way more users and be the top games in the genre, they're basing themselves off the fact that there is no unfair advantage for those that spend money in the game. So, the only way to get better is to just play the game. You gotta get better at it, and even there's no leveling system like you guys put in here for the units, so there really is no unfair advantage even for the people that spend more time if you're a better player you're a better player end of story so like i said there's a few ways you can f still heavily your leveling system i mean there's you know there's only one way you can still have your leveling system, is to turn it into an experience-based thing, where, like I said, it's only rewarded by playing more. The people who play more will have, um, will have a better chance of having higher units. But that being said, um, you guys got to get a better ranking system, even one way or another. Like, whether you, like I said, whether you guys continue giving an unfair advantage to the people that will actually spend money on the game. That's your guys' decision. I think it might kill your game, actually. You'll lose most of your player base that way. Uh, but, hey, uh, you guys go. Uh, it's your choice. But secondly, no matter what you decide, whether to leave the gold in or not, I mean, um, to be able to level up the units, one thing you guys have to do, 100% sure, is 
get a better ranking system, which with much, 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 much more ranks, so that people that aren't playing the game as much can actually play against people that aren't playing the game as much. Whether it takes them a few more minutes to match up, um, a lot of the auto chess games, it takes somewhere between a minute to two to three minutes sometimes if it's a little bit longer to get a game going, but at least you're usually matched up against people that are in your range uh, and that uh, you might actually win the match. They're, they're not facing you against people that there's no way you're going to win against. So, yeah, no matter what you guys do, you have to get a better ranking system with much, 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 much more ranks and increase your wait times a little bit be, uh, to get a match just to make sure that you're matching people of the same caliber because otherwise there's just no point in battling. Like I played uh, at least like five or six matches before this one and uh, my, yeah, my overall opinion is uh, the game has potential. It could be a great game but either number one decide if you guys want to still give the unfair advantage to people that want to spend gold or or make it an experience system which i think is the better way and either way one way or another make a much wider ranking system so uh that's my opinion and uh, if this if you guys are new to the channel like and subscribe and if you liked the content and hit the notification button if you guys want to see more because i'm coming out with content every day also hit up my guy com bonus he does uh red tide content red tides uh auto chess videos so hit him up too he's a good um good at explaining in-game a little bit more sometimes than I do. Sometimes I just kind of say what I'm doing ex instead of explaining why I'm doing it. But, uh, hey. So, uh, yeah. Like I said, first time here, like and, su like, like and subscribe and uh, hit the notification bells if you want to see more content. Otherwise, uh, you guys have a nice day and I'll catch you later, man.